Hi, my name is Sandy Carter and I'm IBM's General Manager for Ecosystem Development and Social Business Evangelist. And welcome so much to our Social Business Coffee Break. Today we have a great session about how you can pop up your organization with an influencer program or what we might call a brand army. Now let's start first by just defining why influencers are important. I think a lot of people know that having strong advocates outside of social is really important, but they're also essential inside of your blogosphere because you really are able to reach new audiences, to help engage in new discussions, attract new people, and also to increase your trust metric. In fact, from the latest IBM CMO study, chief marketing officers see this advocacy by customers, this influence, as a top priority area for digital. And word of mouth recommendation is the primary factor behind almost 50% of all purchasing decisions per McKinsey. So this is definitely an area that you want to pay attention to as you're moving forward. So let's go through a couple of steps about how you might leverage and use these influencers in your business. So step number one, pick your influencers. You can use and leverage Socialytics, some sort of analytics tool to locate those key influencers. It could be an IBM tool like Core Metrics or SPSS. There are also some tools out there that you could start to dip your toe in this, things like Clout, for instance, to identify those influencers. Really locate the strongest advocates in your ecosystem and then start to form a relationship with them as you move forward constantly be adding, constantly re-looking at your influencers. In fact, I get a list every week of my new influencers and constantly am re-looking at that. Number two, engage those influencers. Make them feel part of your community. Shouldn't be you pushing marketing out at them, but you're engaging them, listening to their ideas, maybe inviting them to your in-person events. Train them on some of your materials and what you're doing and leverage them in places of influence. At one of IBM's events, we actually have a red carpet and a special seating spot right up front for our event for all of our top influencers. We call this the IBM Champions Program. Step number three and really bring the value home for those influencers is really to look at the value of those influencers. Measure what they're bringing in. That helps you to really justify to the organization your investment in something like a champions program. Let the influencers know how they're performing. You know, in one particular area, we rated some of the influencers and it really got some great competition going so that because all of these influencers want to gain even more clout online. So make sure you're measuring that value as well. So let's just quickly recap. If you think about the PEP approach, first pick your influencers, engage those influencers, and then really prove the value of those influencers. My name is Sandy Carter. This has been our Social Business Coffee Break.